Breaking news coming in about the Mahayuti's Mahapol win impact after the success of the Larki Bahin scheme. Pressure is on the BJP-ruled states to emulate this. Sources say that UP is studying the feasibility of the scheme. Sources also say that five to six crore women are likely to be covered. Passing over to my colleague Pragya to bring us more on this. Pragya, over to you. So we have seen how successful these Lali Bena and Lali Bena used to have been in Madhya Pradesh and also uh, in Maharashtra. Uh, UP government, we are given to understand that the sources are also uh, mulling that such a scheme can be brought in by 2026. At least two of the installments of it should be given before 2027 assembly election. They have seen what wonder it did with the women voters and uh, what kind of... Uh, uh, you know, the support that BJP has received because of these uh, uh, schemes that have been launched by the state before the assembly elections. So, uh, B uh, B Uttar Pradesh being, you know, the kind of uh, population it has, it also needs to understand the financial bearing of it on the state, and this is what they're also working on. And we're given to understand that Uttar Pradesh is uh, deliberating how to implement it, in which way should it be implemented, and where should the money come from. So, it's an extensive exercise. It shows... Uh, uh, you know, uh, uh, it shows how BJP works and how the government works to ensure that the people can be moved. Even there are some years before the assembly elections, uh, the kind of vision they have and the kind of schemes that they need to launch for that. There is a preparation, unlike BJ, unlike Congress rule state, where they made promises and did not deliver. BJP do not want to do that. And uh, after seeing the success of two uh, uh, women-centric schemes, uh, which has uh, direct benefit transfer of money uh, related to it, BJP is working that in Uttar Pradesh.